There was no sonar in those days, no Loran C, no global positioning system, or bathymetric charts. A diver's greatest fear was losing his supply of air. The sharp rocks on an underwater ledge or the ragged metal on a shipwreck could rip the air hose or puncture the dive suit. Trudging the bottom and lugging a long air hose behind, or climbing through a shipwreck and hammering and cutting a ship for salvage, often had a diver breathing heavy and sucking more air than the tender pumped down. Sometimes a diver blacked out or had strange visions squeezing their way into his brain. 